Marco, how are you? Man? I'm good, man. What's happening? Uh, I just saw your Facebook link, and I was like, "Hey, let 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 let, let let's see what's going on there." <laughs> oh, you know what? I my girls just left, so I got a little bit bored, and I'm like, "What can I do?" I I've been listening. It's a Friday. Normally, I'd be out with my mates, but yeah, I'm just sure. chilling. I'm tired of reading. Might yeah. as well just talk to some real people and make real conversations and connections. How are you doing, man? Awesome. Great, that's awesome. Great, yeah, yeah, no, I, I was meaning to talk to you. Like, I remember you sending the link to me to, to book in a call with you and see if I can help. Um, initially, I wanted to do uh, kind of like a coaching consulting service for social media, all right. And then after that, I was like, oh, do, like, do I really want to do this? And I was like, no, nah, I, I don't really want to do this. Like, I, I more have knowledge in like affiliate marketing and e commerce, so, like, I more have that knowledge. So I was like, I'm going to start to pursue that. So at the moment, I'm setting up a few stores. Uh, one is a shirts, a shirts. I mean, a dresses store, and the other one I'm still thinking about. Um, but eventually, I'd actually like to have my own brand, like my own brand of clothing and products, and like it's going to be called Hustle. That's it. Good work. First yeah. of all, congratulations. A lot of people are probably sitting in their room right now doing a lot of things but you're not you're working all right yeah and um <laughs> and 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 obviously some people are afraid to reach out some people are are not confident in in themselves so Correct. this is also a good break but try not to do too much okay yeah. the reason being you really got to be a jack you you're going to be a jack of all trades and a master of none so you yeah. all you want to do is make sure you're really proficient in one thing so that when yeah. people are going to pick up the phone they call you for are you a web developer are you a um, you know uh, are you a marketer or what do you do because people are too busy to follow you through while you're trying out a lot of things exactly that's right, right? Yeah. I, yeah and i realized that like i realized like i was chasing too many um too many things you know one was e-commerce one was affiliate marketing one was this and i was like like I think I think there's a saying that goes: if you chase two rabbits, you're gonna chase none. But if you chase one, you're gonna chase one. So it's like I gotta just nail down on one thing and it takes, perfect it. It takes 21 years to be 21 years old. Yeah. Yeah. So that's right. Right. So don't yeah. don't expect anything to just come in right now today. You know why? Yeah. Because we have been brought up in watching TV. Somebody, yeah. somebody's born. All right. And uh, they get married, they, uh, they go to college, they get, they get married, um, they divorce, and then they die in a space of 30 minutes. Correct. Yeah. All right. That's an episode. So mm -hmm. we now start thinking that that's what life is supposed to be like. No, yeah. no, 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 no. You've got a whole life ahead of you. Yeah. So whatever you're doing now, I think, are you staying at home with your parents? Yes. All right, if you're staying at home with your parents and they're not charging you rent right now, maximize on the time yeah. that you have to create something of your own. That's right. Yeah, 100%. 100%. And hence, um, yeah, I'd like to go into the whole e-commerce thing and have my own brand and you know, start to get influencers on board. Um, actually, I wanted to get your opinion on it as well. What do you think? Like, what's, what's your perspective on it? Have something that other people are willing to share. Yeah, have, definitely. have something that you're so proud of. Other people can feel that enthusiasm with them as well. And they want to work with you. Yeah, definitely. For sure. For sure. And, and I thought like, well, like when I was thinking about my own brand, like, um, like hustle, you know, like just the name, the word, like everyone knows what it means, you know, whether you're a businessman or, or not, just an old average, human. like you, when you hear the word hustle, you're like, yeah, you, like, you know what that means, you know, so it's good. Yeah. But like, yeah. It, it will be hard for you to own it. Yeah. Because yes, you right. don't own that brand. You don't own yeah. that name. So yeah. you, you should try and make it something that belongs to you that way. You treat okay. it like your own baby. Like like your own. Okay, so uh, I'll make notes as well. Hang on. So so so, so come up so come up with a name. Yeah. Uh, that that uh, that is uh, what do you call it? Like that is uh connected with you basically. Yeah. Exactly. Is, Exactly. Okay. What, what's your what's your last name, Viv? Uh, Kotha. Sorry. Kotha. K O T H A. K O T H A. Kotham. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Do it like that, because right. if something is a Kotham, 
it's a cotton brand, you will do whatever you can to make sure you don't embarrass yourself. Yeah. Because you're right. embarrassing your last name and then that will make you work hard. Right. But if it's, if it's just hustle, you know, if it doesn't work, you'd be like, eh, that's it. I'll yeah, try something that's else. Right. Yeah. That's why yeah. Trump is very successful in his business because he doesn't want his name to go down the drain because it's on every building. Yeah, that's it. Okay, so, so yeah, so, um, okay, yeah, that, yeah, that makes sense. Because if you say hustle and then maybe Gary V says hustle, then you get diluted. Yeah, that's right. Because, yeah, if Gary V says it, then it may think like, Maybe some sort of like sponsorship between me and him. Is, is that right? Exactly. Like, and then right. who, who has the stronger, who makes the loudest hustle? Uh, at the moment, Gary Vee. All right. Sure. So now you, you can't take that away from him. I, I can't. Yeah. And especially like me being, uh, what do you call it? Like just like a starter, you know, just, just entering, you know, just to see what's out there. Um, yeah. But yeah, it's definitely always a dream to, to have my own brand for sure and e-commerce brands so like i just want to have that freedom of like traveling as well like wherever i want when i want and that's where i want to be so yeah so that's where i want to go so so tell me a bit about yourself um prosper i see you do consulting um uh, for marketing services i believe like oh yeah i own live long digital it's um yeah. a digital marketing agency here in uh in melbourne okay we, we, we're doing good stuff, man. <laughs> that's awesome. That's, 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 yeah, no, it's, it's definitely, social media is just one of those things where it's needed everywhere, isn't it? And I think business owners are starting to realize that social media is the way to go. You know, the radio, the TV, the telephone is becoming the old way of marketing, you know, and social media is where we connect on a new demographic, you know. Yeah, it's really interesting eh? because I talked, to, uh, no, I didn't talk, I didn't, I took um, Ty Lopez social media agency course um, and did and did that and that's really cool. It gave me a lot more insight. It gave me a lot more opportunities as well, which I didn't even realize that that was out there. You know, once you get into the groups, you talk to people, you see what they do. It's really interesting. There's like there's heaps of opportunities out there to make money online, I guess. You know, and have that lifestyle. Um, one of the opportunities that I came across was Amazon FBA um, fulfillment by Amazon. Which was very interesting to. Where are you based? Uh, Sydney. Sydney. Oh, you're here in Australia. I'm here Cause, in Australia. Yeah, yeah because yeah. Amazon is coming into Australia. Yeah. You do know that, right? Yes, yes, I do. All right. So, <laughs> yeah. are you placed enough for that opportunity? I haven't even started it yet. I haven't even started. Like, I've took a course to learn it. It, it looks really simple, but I haven't even started it yet. Um, it, I, don't I, think that's, I, don't I think that's it. where. You, if, if you're gonna if you're gonna pivot and do anything I think that's where you want to sort of start off from because once okay. Amazon lands in Australia they won't take as long as they did in America to to blow up right it's now almost eight percent of all the purchases uh, online are on Amazon and in Australia all right now can you imagine yeah. if they're actually based in Australia and there's no longer that waiting for um, you know, for shipment from the from the US, and all the the shipment is now here in Australia. So you want to make yeah. sure you figure out that option. Um, for me, I think I'm already an old dog. I don't want to venture into that, but I can help people brand themselves once they're already in there. Does that make sense? In the Amazon FBA, is it? I I don't like. I took a course on it. I don't really understand it to the extent where I could start it like because it's all about like finding products and then testing it and then doing advertising for it um I, yeah i don't really understand like have you looked into this like have you looked into amazon if you like, i have an understanding i haven't but i've got a, an understanding of it all you're yeah. doing is finding stuff that other people want to find but okay. you don't have the time to search through amazon and you're sure. becoming the person that provides that to them right okay yeah so, right. so whenever they search it in amazon but my product will be the first product that, or first or second that comes up basically people have become lazy and right yep. people have become so lazy that right now they even want you to hold their phone for them so that they can search on google right, right. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you know? yeah. <laughs> they can't even hold their phone all right yeah. so so that's what the the amazon party is going to be you're just going to be finding products that uh, people don't know exist yet and then just 
curating them into something maybe through a Shopify or a Magento shop or something like that to, to the people and, 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 and just becoming a middleman. So yeah, you're sure. basically just, I think maybe becoming a retailer and putting your markup and your commissions, et cetera, et cetera. But yeah. I think it works when you've got high ticket items where people are actually making purchases that, you know, are substantial. Mm -hmm. Yeah, for sure. So, so it's more about finding a niche first and then st starting up a business based on niche and getting the products from Amazon basically. Correct. Like, yeah. But do you want to yeah. really know a pro tip? Just go yeah. into it and then okay. your niche will find you. You will find things that really gravitate to you because the more you stick onto a niche, you will spend six, seven months trying to figure that out and you're yeah. not doing anything. And then at the end of the part, at the end of the, the six months, you figure out that you're not really interested in dog supplements. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you know, mm -hmm. you, yeah. you got to do something you're passionate about. You're right. So right. You know, right now we're having a casual chat, but yeah. it's already translating into a consultation. You know, yeah. because I absolutely mm. love what I do, man. Like it's, you know, like right now, you know, I'm just chilling at home and I'm thinking who else can I help or who can I talk to so that yeah. I can, you know, have them have a business that's profitable and enjoyable. Yeah, for sure. For sure. 100%. What would you think yeah, of this call right now? Uh, I think, I think it's great. I think uh, I love your excitement and energy as well. It, it, it makes this call very live. <laughs> Look, it's what quarter to 10 right now. PM. Yeah. Yeah. You're doing yeah. well. Some people will be out drinking. Yeah. Well, yeah, no, I've always had that like entrepreneurial mindset um, of trying to like just get somewhere in the business world, or, you know, and yeah, this year, this year was the year where I just took that action and bought Tyler Lopez course, bought Amazon course, looked at all these different options, like can I feel so many people, you know, like, like, like yourself, you know, like, um, and finding out what people do. And it's, it's been, it's been an awesome journey so far, which is good. Um, so what I, so would you advise me on Amazon to list like every different product, like everything and well, then find out which I can't advise you on Amazon. I'm not quite sure, but what you sure. would do, what you'd really, really do now is, Go on, go on like groups of on Google and find out what people are. Go on buy, swap, and sell, um, or on the marketplace. Yeah. Marketplace. So on Facebook, right? Yeah, yeah. Facebook Marketplace. Yeah. Have you ever seen Facebook Marketplace? So I'll have a look now. One second. Okay. Yeah. There's what's called Facebook Marketplace. So there's like <laughs> that little shop that's on there. Mm, oh yeah, Facebook Marketplace. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. There it is. Yeah, exactly. Find out what people are selling. Right. Okay. And, and, and then, and then based on that, you'll see the demand of what, what, yeah. what people are wanting. Right. Yeah. yeah. How many people have viewed that thing? How many people have actually seen that thing and made an inquiry about it? And then yeah. that would sort of give you an idea of what they're purchasing on the free market. Yeah. Like, like, like this, for example, like a 21.5 inch iMac late 2983 views only posted an hour ago yeah as well so, so, so that will give you an indication of what the market is actually looking at so yeah, without the, you trying to decide what people are searching the marketplace is, is already giving you answers it's so already giving, you would go yeah. on amazon and find out do you have a supplier for mics that is willing to give you a really good discount or a deal or an affiliate fee and then yeah. just yeah put it out there start it off maybe on the um, started off on the marketplace there and then try it off on, on like eBay, try it off any other marketplace as well and buy yeah. swap and sell groups. And once you've got that going, um, yeah, you start seeing what the market wants. Cause now the market is a fecal sort of environment. Not a lot of people are sticking to one thing because our concentration span has just gone berserk. Yeah, that's right. You know what yeah. I mean? So people are not sticking to one particular job. So yeah. they're not going to need, um, you know, a particular, uh, I don't know what they were buying for a long time. You know, yeah, people yeah. are no yeah. longer wanting to own things as much because they are maybe staying in the Airbnb where the, 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 the stuff is already provided. So you could yeah. put your niche as furniture and you find that people are no longer buying furniture. So, Go on what the market is already looking at. What are they responding to? What are they suggesting that they want purchases off of? And just yep. go with that. 
Yeah, I've noticed on this marketplace, there's a lot of technology items, a lot of technology, like cameras, like GoPros, like what else, watches, phones, laptops. So I think we're a very technology-driven society, which is true, you know, if we look on it. Like, and we're also a, what do you call it? Like, like when we buy a new phone, that phone, like Max will have it for a year or two and then throw it out and then again upgrade to a new one. It's called, um, it's called so controlled obsolescence. When, controlled obsolescence, yeah. Yes. When a company just, you know, puts an expiry date on a product, because if you, if you don't, you would be, you would still have the, you know, the phone you had 10 years ago. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. So, 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 so that means like companies today would like, like, like when you buy a product, like there would be expiration date on that. Correct. Like there'll be, there'll be a day where the phone just randomly dies so that you go get another one. Is, is that how companies well, they, they've product. got to protect. Yeah, they've got to protect the longevity of 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 the business. Of, because of the if business. the iPhone didn't die or didn't just you know or the Samsung didn't die, then you wouldn't buy the next one, would you? Like right yeah, now, yeah, yeah, I don't yeah. think phones are any different. It's just maybe a bigger screen or you know faster processor, but it's not as different as were you were you there during the Nokia days? Yes, yes. I, I, in fact, right. my first phone was a Nokia. Yeah. yeah. All right. So Nokia started off like this and then it became smaller and then it came wider. Wider. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. <laughs> you know, so you could notice the difference, but iPhone has been like this for years now. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. You know, and, if, you, and, if you're not tech savvy, all you just see is a screen and you don't know what's inside. You know, yeah. the camera is just the same, whether it's a five, whether it's a six, whether it's a seven, maybe it's just higher pixels and a little bit bigger, but mm. you know, it's, it's, it's not any different. Exactly. Yeah. Like if you notice, like every time they, um, they, they introduce a new phone, all they're changing is this one small aspect, whether it's adding like another pixel oh, that, from eight to nine megapixel now, you know, and people go crazy for that. Like once you people, advertise, people, people, people are hanging outside. So this is what you've got to do. You've got to create a brand where people are climbing all over each other to buy your stuff. To buy but, so so uh, so one example uh, uh, yeah so one example would be like Kogan wouldn't it be like Kogan would be a prime example of that wouldn't it like say that again uh, so, so so Kogan the online technology store yeah uh, would be pretty much an example of that where people want to go there to find the best prices the cheap prices and get that same phone that is like hundred dollars cheaper or hundred fifty dollars like that's, like, that's what you've got to create that's what you've yeah. got to create. Yeah, um, right. and, 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 and it's called the Kotham brand. And I've already seen what the, 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 the sign would look like. Write K O T H at M. K, K O T T H at, at M. Oh, at M. Okay, wait, hang on. One sec. I'll start a new page. I'll start a new page. K. K O T H at that's your brand, my friend. Don't go yeah. searching anything else. That that one right there. Whatever you're gonna do, play around with it. Yeah, and and that's gonna be a technology store, basically technology online store. Because because yeah. if you're gonna go and try and and fish out something else that wasn't meant for you, you won't work hard for it. Yeah. That's right. That's exactly right. And with the technology store, I could just pretty much build it off Shopify, and then because Shopify is the easiest, uh, it's, like, uh, it's the easiest, and everything's pretty much controlled for you. You just have to check in on it every day. Um, if you want to make some updates, yeah, that's probably the easiest. Have you tried WooCommerce as well? I'm right. not. I'm not a retail dude, man. <laughs> oh, okay. Right. <laughs> you okay. can tell I'm, I'm not. I'm not a retail dude. I just. Yeah. I just really like, you know, because the people are going to be coming to the internet for information, and yeah, once you've got that shop, you know, you you you're going to be the person doing maybe the reviews of whatever is the latest. They would the read that from you, and automatically you just send them your links. So that's that's going to be your in thing, and yeah. you gotta really love it. You know, you it. gotta really, really be passionate about it. Yeah, that's right. You know, yeah, for just, sure. just be willing to talk to random strangers and you not knowing who's gonna show up. You know, just because you've got so much faith in what you're doing, it's it's just yeah. 
Yeah, for sure. So um, another question I wanted to ask you is, you know, like, like when you reach out to customer support, like through any business, like how they outsource to, for example, like India or China or like wherever around the world, how do companies actually go and approach that? Like, do they actually go to some sort of company, some outsourcing company, and then they go, uh, we want you to take care of our customer service, emails, uh, phone calls. Is that how it works? Or do we have an idea with that? Oh, okay. So you mean you, you want to, once you, you, you set up, you want to have like an outsourced, um, oh, there's a lot. Google it. Look up yeah, right. Philippines um, VA or um customer service uh agents oh right. they're, they're there there's a lot most of my yeah. team is in the philippines the guys that do my seo they're all right. in the philippines um yeah. i don't trust um, the other places because philippines they really they really are starting to to learn the real good english so yeah. even if they're writing you would think it's somebody from australia um, right okay yeah. so, so, so philippines yeah yeah no so for for at the end of the day um you yeah you could always look it up not everything you want man you could always google it yeah yeah for sure yeah because yeah like um i think the only thing oh like i'll have a few people so this is how i'm thinking about it like you know i'll do all the initial work to add all the phones do everything then i'll have one guy to do the seo um for the store and probably one person to do the social media as well and a few people depending on how big my store grows and how many calls we're getting in probably to do maybe two to three to start off maybe two two to start off with mm -hmm. for customer service um and go from there yeah it sounds like a good plan doesn't it <laughs> no for real i mean at the end yeah. of the day just start it the thing yeah. is once you start it the the how will come the way will right. come the people will yeah. show up on your front door saying right. a v let's let's do this together let's let's work together i've got i've got this idea let's put it all together and before you know it you might pivot but if you're known for one thing if you're yeah. known for something and if people can trust that you're going to be there how old are you right now if you don't mind me asking uh 22 okay yeah. you still have yeah. ages to go bro yeah that's right yeah you know but, yeah between you and me right now there's like 12 years which yeah. is almost half of your life existence. Yeah, yeah. You know? So <laughs> yeah. so you, you you don't don't be don't be too hard on yourself. Yeah. Yeah, I think I think within me, like after getting into like Tyler, there's social media agency course and everything. Um like I think now I have a sense of urgency in my mind. Like every day I go, I'm like, I gotta get something on, I gotta get something on, I gotta get somewhere. You know, I have a sense of urgency in my mind to get somewhere. Um, so I'm constantly trying to. And, okay, and, let's and, and, let's see let's see what what have you got now? What have you got? Um, so in the moment, I uh, so at the moment, like what I'm doing right now. Yeah, what have yeah, you got so, right now? Okay, so I'm I'm in the process of um, designing a dresses store, like a girls' dresses, and I have a jewelry store as well. I okay, like you. So you designing girls' dresses. Correct. Wh why girls' dresses? um because i feel like there's a need for them yeah but um, do you wear girls dresses no are you gonna know what sizes and what bra sizes and how it fits on the butt and and things like that no no are you gonna know what's in fashion uh no no right are you gonna know which area or which city likes longer skirts of the same version of you know what i mean you you want to go into something that you you know inside out right okay all right because mm. because the thing is you you would think that yes you're putting dresses out there but they're probably not in yeah right okay yeah i definitely didn't think about that <laughs> no no for real look at this look at this right now if 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 maybe you start talking about suits yeah do you know anything about suits um i know that one they have to fit well and two that they have to look good like they have to fit well and look good um and that and they can't be like um so so like here it, it can't be like overhanging it has to be you know perfectly um the color combination has to be really cool you know with the shoes doesn't match with the shirt doesn't matter with the tie do you need a pocket square 
yeah, I, I do. Yes, yes. Yeah. That's just the basics, bro. Right. Okay. Like, like, like my two-year-old knows that about suits. Right. All right. Yeah. So yeah, I'm trying to I'm trying to show you that there's there's a whole world behind the hem. Yeah. Of a dress means something to a woman. Right. Okay. Is, is, is it tucked in, in such a way that it's heavy enough that when the wind comes, it doesn't... Do you it know, it's, there's right. small things like that. Yeah. Right. All right? Okay. So, <laughs> so yeah. you want to make sure that you're going to be ordering things that people actually want. You go into conversations with them. They talk about it. And then they talk about when they've worn it. And, you know, how they felt. Does it make yeah. them feel sexy, sophisticated? Or does it make them feel, you know, wanted, appreciated? Women feel we think. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> so yeah. so you, you can never really get to... Have you ever sold anything on that website? No. 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 I haven't even launched it yet. I, yeah, I, I, man. Um, yeah. I'm happy maybe we had this chat. I'm not the devil's advocate. Yeah, yeah, right. Yeah, I'm yeah, not yeah, but, saying don't go ahead with that, but I want you to go into something you particularly have a knowledge about. Yeah, Would you be able to talk to a girl who's crying right now at 10 or 3 p.m. discussing dresses? No, <laughs> no, <laughs> no. Can you imagine I'm working right now? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Um, All right, so you want to go into something that you really know you can withstand. Yes, there's, there's a monetary, um, you know, lure to it. You know, you, you know you can sell. There's a demand. Yes, girls go to uh, formal events. They go to um, balls. They go on dates, etc., etc. But do you know what constitutes a lady to decide whether to wear a dress or pants? No, I don't know. No, but yeah. So yeah, I, I I I didn't realize that I need this extensive research. Yeah, like like honestly, you made me realize that I need this extensive research with this. <laughs> right, I'm lost now. <laughs> no, 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 no. I don't want I don't want to leave you there because yeah, then yeah. that would be very mean of me. Oh no 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 yeah 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 no, no but as in as in, as in like uh like like you got me thinking you know you got me thinking in a deeper perspective you know yeah. right you really yeah. gotta go in for something that you are able to speak about 24 7 yeah so for me it would be it would definitely be technology so it could be yeah phones phones laptops technology so do that and, yeah. and you know what you can start doing? Just start reviewing phones as they come in or, and you could always find out what other people have already said and then they just say it in your own words. Right. Okay. Yeah. Is it like, so, so as in like YouTube videos. Yeah. Yeah. Cause, YouTube. Cause you gotta put content out there so that people would know, like, and trust you. Yeah. All right, and, 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 and that's the only way because there's no way a girl is going to come and buy a dress from you because sh- she also needs somebody to tell her to be confident. Yeah. And I don't right. think you are in that space. Yeah, I'm not. I'm definitely not, no. You, you are not going to know if this, you know the biggest question that women always have, does my butt look good in this? Yeah, that's right. That, that's exactly right. <laughs> and and you're just going to come out as a pervert. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. <laughs> right. Yeah. So, so do you think need... girls are going to trust you now? No. no Let alone women. Where are you going to sell it to them and how are they going to find you? Fine. Yeah, that's right. Because I was thinking of doing like social media marketing, advertising at Facebook and Instagram and get influencers to shout, shout out um, my store. Cause, cause, cause like, that's, that's how I was thinking about doing it. Um, no, you, you can still do that, but do you see how hard it's going to be? Because these people are going to have questions for you. Yeah. That's and right. you, you're not going to, you're not going to be there to answer them all. Yeah, that's right. That's exactly so why right. would you be setting yourself up for something that is just going to be a disaster for you? Cause you're going to need sleep. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. Mm-hmm. 
yeah so i think i think the best thing what i got to do now is look into the technology store and see um technology online store and and start building that like start researching start um seeing how to get suppliers um do you know to, what i would suggest technology wise yeah internet of things all those alexa type things you know like the the apple radio not the apple radio but the the stuff that is voice activated um voice activated yeah it's called the amazon echo or oh, amazon echo yeah 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 that's where things are headed to yeah so voice activation all right by the time you catch up by the time you catch up with the knowledge and the know-how of all those things and how they work and stuff like that yeah by the time the mainstream is, is starting to sort of sell them you would have the knowledge so i would no, deploy no. myself into that right now if you are passionate about it and really start studying about it it takes reading about it a couple of blogs as long as you're one blog ahead of the rest of of of, uh, of, of you know the market you you you've yeah. got a product yeah so so is it just one product or multiple both both oh, this, it's, it's it's a whole new revolution right now search all the seo search is going to be going through voice 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 yeah. activation all right so yeah. if you can start studying that aspect and 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 the whole alexa and voice recognition type products my friend you are going to be on the next wave of what's hot yeah okay voice activation and and, and how do i and what would be your best advice on how to study it how do i start like say if i was to start tomorrow how would i start studying it and how do okay. i yeah hold on one second Okay, so it's called Alexa Skills. Alexa Skills. Okay, so Alexa Skills. Hang on, I'll, I'll type it on Google now. One second. Mm -hmm. So, okay, Alexa Skills. Hmm. Amazon developer. Hang on. Um, how do I paste a link? Actually, no, I paste it through Facebook to, to your messenger, okay? But mm -hmm. Just to make sure we're on the right page. One second. Oh, did I? Did I? Is that it? Yes, I think. Yeah, I just noticed that. Yeah. Okay. So, so, so start learning on there, basically. Oh, okay. So, so, so you pretty much name a thing and it does it for you. So play music, interaction mode. Do I say next? Ah, oh, okay, okay. So you pretty much put a bunch of inputs and whenever you say the thing like, hey Alexa, um, turn on the lights or something, it'll do it for you. Is that right? All right. So now what you're doing now is figuring out what other gadgets work with Alexa. What other things are possible with that new Amazon thing? All right. Okay. So, so you go in, you, you find out all the things that is capable with, with, with Amazon, uh, that Alexa thing, turn on the lights. Okay. So you turn on the lights. So you find out what other gadgets can you connect and then you put them all part of your, your, your the things that you can sell. 
Uh huh. Okay. Yes. Yeah, so pretty much, when a customer goes to my website, they pretty much buy it as a as a like a one pound package, and they get everything, right? Right. Uh huh. But the sense. thing, the thing is, I can't, I can't legally vouch to say that I know anything about this, but I know this will be a thing. Yeah, for sure. Because if you notice, like home automation is already popular. Um, I remember, I think a year or yeah, as you're saying. I think a year or two early it was launched. I remember like seeing ads on TVs for home energy, and today it's blown up. So yeah, I think you're right. The next thing is going to be um, artificial intelligence, which is pretty much Alexa. Yeah. Um, and yeah, because I remember reading a blog the other day. It's saying like what jobs are going to be there, what jobs are not going to be there. Um, and artificial intelligence was like came up on the number one, number one list. It's going to be there. It's, that's what's going to be the next. Uh, next way of business, I guess. Um, so yeah, one hundred percent right. So, so when you to... start reading about this, you become an expert in this field. Now you know right. how you can pair certain <coughs> things together to to get whatever outcome, all right? And then you continuously study, study, study all of those things, and before you know it, you're the only person that really knows how to how to deal with this Alexa. Um, product, product, yeah, yeah, and then like slowly you build a following and then go from there. Basically, can you imagine you just being the only person talking about? Hey, today, do you know you can pay your Alexa with your phone? This is what you can do, yada yada yada, and your video gets a thousand hits, and then people go and buy the thing that you're talking about on your on your video. On the video, yeah, that's right. Because yeah, if you notice, like like no one talks about it on YouTube, so. Yeah, I, I, like, I like the fact how you're making me think in a different mindset where, you know, like think what's going to be the next thing, basically. You know, I, I like that. I, I, I really like that. Um, probably one more question, question as well. I have a friend who's studying actuary and he wants to get into the entrepreneurship world. And mm -hmm. he was saying he wants to get into share market. And I was like, um, well, if you're going to study, well, if you're studying actuary, you're obviously good at math. So I think that's a good idea to go into share market. Um, what would be your opinion? He wants to learn the whole entrepreneurship thing. Um, he doesn't know where to go, I guess. And I don't know how to read him, like how to, how to guide him in a sense. Um, okay. Actual science. Actuary. Not actuary. Actuary. Isn't actuary to do with um, insurance and insurance. calculating risk and things like that? Correct. Yes. All right. So yes. you know what he can do? He can position himself as an actual expert so he can yeah. work with real estate agents. He can work with uh, investors. He can work with anybody else that deals with high volume uh, money and risk, right? right? Or mining places. So all he's got to do is create a portfolio where he can put out content so that when mm -hmm. those people are searching, how do I calculate certain things? How do I, whatever. And then, all he does is maybe coach people or he can consult people using his expertise. Right. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Because he does want to go into the coaching world. So yeah, yeah. for sure. Okay. Yeah, because he still has like another three years, I think till he finishes, but he wants to start now. And I think, you know, while he's learning, I, I did say to him, I think you need to start a YouTube channel and start putting some free Just build, Building a brand, get known and step up as an authority and create whatever, everything that we do has steps, all right? And yeah. people are trying to run away from the pain. So whatever yeah. pain that he can solve for people, he can break it down into four or five steps and teach yeah. people that. That's right. all there yeah. is. Yeah, that's, all, that's all he needs to do. Right, yeah, I'll have a conversation with him tomorrow. I'll, I'll, I'll mention you as well. Um, actually, actually, I'll send him over to you. I'll, I'll message, uh, maybe we'll send like a group message and he can talk to you and you probably get a better idea. Um, would that be good or? No, I, I don't mind. It's okay. I'm, I'm open to, you know, just like we just did random chat and we yeah. decided to create something special. Yeah. Awesome. So, 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 so is there anyone else on the school? It's just me, isn't it? It's just so me. far it's so far it's just you. As soon as I started talking to you, you know what I did? I went and I deleted that. Um... Oh, Oh, awesome. <laughs> yeah. Cause, cause I felt like, I felt like I had to respect what you what what are you coming up with some people oh, okay. are probably gonna just come and you know talk randomly but i you know you were sincere and then i just thought i'd give you all my time 
<laughs> thank you so much. I really appreciate that, Prosper. Thank you so much. Um, yeah, wow. Like I, I loved how this call um, gave me the opportunity to like open up in a different mindset um, of what's going to be next. And I love how you advised me that you know, like artificial intelligence, home intelligence is going to be the next thing. Um, you should start looking at that. And yeah, thank you so much. I just can't. I just can't thank you enough. Like, <laughs> well, if you really, really want to thank me, I will let you leave a really nice review on my page so that people would would you do that? Yeah, sure. Well, which one? Um, I've just sent you the, the link there. Whenever you're ready, just don't mind. Just put it whenever you're ready. So from on Facebook? Yeah, I just sent you a chat in this in this thing here. Okay, one second. Mm, chat. Oh, reviews. Oh, there it is. Okay. Yeah. So I don't know if I spelt reviews correctly. If it's not leading to the page, it should. That's right. I'm just loading it now. One second. Oh yeah, there we go. Cool. Awesome. Yeah, no, um, I'd love to keep you updated on my journey um, as to what I'm doing. I'll, I'll probably message you every now and then. And no, because yeah, what we've just created here, man, I'm going to want to see it happening either, either not with you or somebody else. Yeah, for sure. hundred percent. Yeah. But my yeah. disclaimer is this is only going to work if you put in the work. I'm not sure if this is a thing or if people want it, but I can yeah. see the direction of which things are headed to. And if you start off with this new product, when Amazon comes in, obviously they're going to try and sell it. Yeah. All right. And then you already know what it's compatible with, how you can expand its use, what other tools you can put together with it. You already have the skill. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, hundred percent. So, so, so I think it's not on Amazon yet. It's coming though. It's it's on the way. Well, you mean Alexa? Yeah, yeah. No, it's already it's already a product. The 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 uh -huh. the, 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 the radio speaker is called the Echo. Oh right, ready. Oh, the Echo. Okay, right. Yeah. So, so Alexa is a brand, is it? Yeah, no, Alexa, Alexa is a brand. So you, you've got to oh. learn what Alexa can do and is compatible with. So oh. I'm not really sure how it all works, but yeah, I know yeah. you will find your way around it. Sweet. Yeah, I'll definitely, I'll definitely have a look into it a bit more for sure. Okay, great. Thank you so much, Prosper. I really appreciate this call. Thanks, buddy. No problem, man. Enjoy the rest yeah. of your evening. Yeah, no, thank you. You too. Thank you. I'll talk to you soon. No worries, yeah. man. Bye. Bye.